give it up for Mr. Lopario. Going on, it's your boy, Mr. Locario, the bad boy of the dating game. What's good? So, listen, guys, I need to tell you, man, when you are out here in the dating game, right, you're going to at some point meet some chick that you're going to be dealing with, and you're going to be really, really feeling this girl. You understand? And what's going to happen is that when you're really feeling her, right, you are going to start sort of acting out of character. You're going to start doing things that you normally probably wouldn't do um, because you like her so much. You understand? So you might end up thinking about her a lot and, you know, you want to call her a little bit more than you usually call her a, a chick. You understand? You, 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 uh, when you're, when you meet her, you're just like extra cupcake in and you're just like really, really like into this chick. So you're just going above and beyond and you're sweating this girl heavy. You understand? But the thing is, is that when you when you're when this happens, you have to check yourself. You understand? Because you're gonna start doing things and, and acting out of character almost to the point where you might even end up simping and you're usually I mean, you're not on some sim shit, but you might end up going in, in the direction of sim shit because you're getting all emotional about this girl. Now it's it's okay for you to actually have um, you know, feelings for a chick. There's nothing wrong with that. But the thing is is that you don't want to get to the point where you're acting out of character, or, or even to the point where uh, you not really even getting to see this chick or hang out with her here and there and whatever, to the point where if that's happening, you don't want to get to the point where you're feeling uh, upset or sad or, you know, uh, you know, it's, it's, it's really something that's making you feel not so good because you can't see her or meet up with her like that. It can get to that point. <laughs> you understand what I'm saying? I've been in, I've been in situations like that in the past where, you know, I'm, I'm dealing with chicks here and there. Then there's that one chick who I'm just feeling heavy. I'm like, oh, man, I'm thinking about the chick. I'm like, I'm, I'm like calling her a little too much or texting her a little too much. And then it, it, it kind of like makes the situation not really flow well because you're not really being cool, calm and collected and just chilling and enjoying the moment. You're just you're just you, you want her so bad. You want it to work out so bad. You want to see her so bad that you end up doing so much extra shit. Do you understand what I'm saying? You end up becoming needy. You end up, you know, making that chick or, you know, that, that, that girl you're dealing with, you know, uh, connected to your happiness. So you, you're, you're unhappy if you can't see her or you're unhappy if, you know, you text her or call her and she doesn't call you back. So now, you know, you're making this chick become your happiness. You understand? You're dependent on this chick now because you're so emotionally invested in this woman. You see what I'm saying? And this shit, if it hasn't happened to you yet, I guarantee you at some point, it's going to happen to you. You're going to feel it and you're going to be like, okay, this is what the fuck he was talking about. Let me check myself. Let me chill before I, I you know, I, I end up, you know, doing all this dumb shit. You feel what I'm saying? So that's all I'm saying is that there's going to come a point in time where you deal with a girl who you're really, really feeling and you're going to want, you're going to have those feelings of, oh man, I want to see her, I want to get with her, I want to do this, I want to do that. And you know, it's okay to try to holler, but you don't want to do too much to where you're basically playing yourself and you're basically doing all this extra, you know, out of pocket shit. The thing is, if the girl likes you, she's going to, you know, hit you up. She's going to connect with you. You guys are going to see each other. So you don't have to do all this extra type of shit. You feel what I'm saying? And by you doing the, all that extra type of shit, sometimes you basically scare the girl off because you're doing way too much. You're being too needy. You're being, uh, you know, a little too, uh, like, crazy about the whole situation. So, you know, if you feel that ever happening, you meet a chick that that, that inspires those feelings, you understand? Just, just take note of it, but still chill and calm down. You feel what I'm saying? Because I don't want you guys out there simping and doing all this other extra craziness. You feel me? So that's all I want to say for today. Um, Listen, guys, click the link below to get um, tickets to my seminar, Reclaim the Game, New Dating Rules for Men. All right? So I'm going to holler at you guys later. Remember, the truth is inside you. Peace. I'm out.
Master the game by joining dating and life coach Mr. Locario live in New York City on Friday, May 15th at So Techie Spaces for his new seminar, Reclaim the Game. Mr. Locario has some exclusive new realistic approaches to the dating game that will help you be successful with women. Purchase your tickets at MrLocario.com. Space is extremely limited, so pick up your tickets today at MrLocario.com. That's M-R-L-O-C-A-R-I-O.com. MrLocario.com.